Our lead question comes in from Cassidy out of Queens, New York. Cassidy writes, I found your show on how Inco terms work very helpful, but how do I use them to take better control of my freight? Keep up the great work. And when it comes to international freight, few letters leave shippers more glassy-eyed than the 11 three-letter abbreviations that make up Inco terms. Used correctly and to your advantage, they can increase revenue, limit risk, and empower your supply chain. One could argue that they're the three most important letters on any commercial invoice. You can find this episode and all of our previous episodes at abornandco.com slash podcast or simply search Consulting Logistics on your favorite podcast player of choice. Take care and happy shipping.